Hey everybody, Scott here. Today we're going to talk about a solar bug zapper. You know, we love solar here. We have so many solar yard lights and everything around the pool. It's great. But we also, it's this time of year, the bugs start coming out. And so we want to be able to get rid of some of those mosquitoes and gnats and fruit flies and anything else that happens to come along uh, that will be attracted to this type of light and fly right into it and then listen to them sizzle. And that's kind of the fun thing about having these, at least for me, is to know that those bugs are getting caught. Anyway, this is really super easy to use. It's pretty much plug and play. It also can be charged via USB, which is fantastic. Um, it takes about three and a half hours to fully charge it via USB. There's, it's fully waterproof. There's a little rubber plug right here for the USB spot. There's an on-off switch on the other side that's got a rubberized button on it. It shuts off when it's held towards direct light. So when the sun's on it, it's not going to be on. When the sun's away from it, it's going to turn back on. And so at about dusk, it'll turn on and then continue to run throughout the night and clean up the bugs that are attracted to it. You know, you can use it also for a light. I mean, it's it's it doesn't put out a tremendous amount of light, but it does put out enough for like a little walkway. Or if you were camping and you wanted it outside your tent, there would be a little bit of light at the doorway of your tent. So that would make it that would make it nice. Or outside a motorhome, great. Anywhere that you're sitting, it'll cover it about 430 square feet or so maximum area. And so you could put it stake it into the ground you know, anywhere near you and and have a bug zapper that's with you that you don't have to do anything other than expose it to the sun during the day and let it do its job at night. So to put it together, it's real easy. You've got the, the poles, the ground poles that go in. Just put it, put the ground pole in. You can select different lengths. If you want to have just a short light like that, you would just simply put the stake here now, or you've got an additional pole that you can put in, which would then and then add the stake, the ground stake to the bottom right here. So that makes it pretty long, it's about 30 inches off the ground when it's off the ground like that. I think I kind of like it when it's shortened and it's just down kind of low to the ground and it would sit about that high. We think that these are um, just fantastic. We really like the idea of it and I especially love the idea of it that it's solar. It doesn't cost any money to run. It lasts, it runs for a long time and let the sun uh, do its job. Anyway, we'd like to thank the sponsor for sending it to us, and we're going to give this a thumbs up.